Good morning, Lehigh County. And I know in the last 11 weeks, there has not been a lot of good news, but uh, today I, I think I have some good news that I want to share with you. But first, the date is rapidly coming. Next Tuesday uh, will be the last day that you can apply at votespa.com. That's to get your mail-in ballot. We've got about 35, 36,000 ballots already. So if you don't want to go in line, please do that. And if, if you will go on the morning call site and the Lehigh County website, you will see that there's a number of polling places that have changed or moved. So on election day, if you did not do the mail-in and you go to your normal spot, it might not be there. Uh, some of the churches, some of the daycare centers, some of the senior centers uh, definitely uh, have requested we did not do this there due, due to the virus, and we understand that. So we've moved places like Agriculture Hall now, some fire companies. So please check that out if you are going to be going to the polls on Election Day. Now, some good news. You know, the Lehigh Valley ranks third in economic growth for the last year. We are right now looking at approximately $54 billion in growth and services. 54% of our workers are still working in necessity positions. But that means we still have a high number out of work. And that's why it becomes so important that we keep doing what we have been doing. Yesterday, the Lehigh Valley Hospital Network and St. Luke's said their numbers are now down. And thanks to what everybody has been doing with the washing hands, social distance, and wearing masks, they're down in the about 100, 125 beds now from where they were several weeks ago at 225 and higher. But the, the n nice part about this and why I'm proud of what we have done, right to our east over in New Jersey, their numbers are three and four times higher than ours. But thanks to the mask, the washing hands, and keeping our distance, we've managed not to put that extra burden on our hospitals. And now, as we're getting ready, hopefully to be moving into yellow, we've got to maintain the things that are bringing our numbers down. Let's keep with the social distancing. Let's keep with the masks. Let's use our common sense like we've had the last 11 weeks. And we might get out of this sooner than later. But I do want to say congratulations to Lehigh County. Our numbers are going down because of the efforts that you have been following. So please, with Memorial Day coming up, remember the real reason, but let's add to the reason we're celebrating not only our veterans who gave their lives for this country, but for our health care workers, our people on the front lines right now that are putting their lives at risk to make sure we stay healthy. Please use Memorial Day to remember those people. Thanks and stay safe and healthy.